Hello, this is Donovan with Beeswax, and welcome to my series on the TextMate bundle for FileMaker. In this video, I'm going to give you a quick overview of how to interact with FileMaker's clipboard. Now, the reason you may want to interact with FileMaker objects as text and TextMate is that it gives you tremendous power over the development process. For example, you can do find and replace operations, say if you were changing the variable in a script. You can also store objects for reuse things like common script steps or fields. You can also extract information from those objects. For example, you can pull a list of colors being used on your layout, or information about a bunch of fields you copy to the clipboard. You can even generate objects using this technique. In later posts, I will show you how to take a list of field names and generate fields from them. Or you can even take arrays and generate scripts out of them. So there's a lot of power available to you when you begin working with FileMaker objects as text. The basic process for doing this is pretty straightforward. You copy the objects in FileMaker. It could be scripts, script steps, tables, fields, layout objects. And then you get that clipboard object as XML text. Now when you see this in TextMate, it'll be in the form of XML. You may also want to start at this point and actually just generate that XML which I'll show you how to do later. Then once you have it modified, you load the text back onto the clipboard as a FileMaker object. There's a bit of conversion that happens there. So you're not actually just copying text to the clipboard. And then you're ready to paste. Just go back to FileMaker and find the spot where you'd like to paste in your newly modified objects. Let's go through a simple example. I have a basic layout. Let me copy the field name and field. I'll come back into TextMate, pull that object off of the clipboard. You can see here what the XML looks like. There's, it's called an FM XML snippet. Describes the layout, object style. You have an object. Look, that's our field label. Let's just change that to first name. Now throw that back onto the clipboard and paste. Here you can see. We have our object back, but with a new field label. That's a simple example. Don't worry if you miss something, because in following posts, I will show you the tips and tricks of how to actually do this in TextMate. Thank you, and happy file making.